As a mother who lost a child, every day my heart breaks. What is happening in Gaza? I cannot imagine as a mother having kids, having grandkids, you know, and going through all of this. I cannot enjoy Mother's Day while seeing my people back in Gaza. Moms are not enjoying Mother's Day. Watching this devastation in Palestine has really hurt my soul. No mother should have to worry about being able to feed their child, worry about their children being killed in bombing. No mother should have to worry about what would happen if they were bombed and could no longer take care of their children. Who would take care of them? Oh, my heart is with you, grandmothers and mothers, and I'm so, so, so sorry that my tax dollar is being used to slaughter your children and your grandchildren. It's totally disgusting. I'm doing everything I can to stop it, and my heart is with you. We see you. We see you, and we love you, and we're trying to do everything we can to help. I commit myself to be in the streets, to be in the halls of Congress, to be doing all I can to disrupt what is taken as normal, this violent, destructive, unspeakable that we are living through so that it will be over and so that next Mother's Day, those mothers left can have a beautiful day of peace. I am here today to advocate for the mothers of Palestine the children of Palestine, so we can actually move forward with peace in the region for everybody, because this devastation has to stop. We're trying to do everything we can to show our love, to get you aid, and all the things that you need to continue to be the mothers that you want to be. And my heart goes out to you. My love goes out to you. What a horrible Mother's Day we are living through. May we learn to not raise our children to kill another mother's child. And our hearts, our hearts are, are breaking with yours and for yours, and we love you.